Aw, there you go, see you, Shiro. Chloe's happy to see you. <laughs> I can't say the feeling's mutual, but sure. Aw, come on, Shiro. Why did Chloe ever do to you? She's the only uh, one trying she's the only one trying to emotionally support you for all this. Come on. Come on. You know, Chloe doesn't deserve that. Come on. Fine. <laughs> I'm sorry, Chloe. <laughs> Okay, so last time we found Jericho. So let's see what's next. I think the next chapter is uh, uh, Kara. Either a, well, yeah, either a Kara one or I think it's a Connor one. Yes, yeah, it is. probably Connor. Yeah. Yay! Something fun. All right, Hank is now warm towards. All right, Shiro. Now this is a now you have to reconcile with Hank. So basically, this is going to be a big opportunity for you to either right. strengthen the bond with him or weaken it. So make sure you make good choices. Define good. Uh, <laughs> well, that's the thing, Shiro. Hank doesn't like you being overly nice because that's condescending. Like, so you have to. Oh yeah, I need to get out of the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <you have to, laughs> I, I have to get out of the car. Yeah, you, you have to approach this like if you were actually talking to him. So. All right. All right. So he's not right now. He's just ordering chicken. You wanna flutter? Last shot tip gave you a religious bitch. Oh yeah, and this guy here is called Pedro. Like <laughs> That's not stereotypical at all. The Puerto Rican is all the right, one all right, all right, all right, Chiroy, we have to scan this oh well, okay, you lost your opportunity. That's okay, you don't need to scan him huh? anyway. It was just for the sake of having an extra choice for later, but that's okay. Yeah, the guy's not important anyway, so Oh, I didn't see a prompt anyway, so That's okay, I'll warn you next time it have it appears. Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a damn poodle. <laughs> Come on, Shiro. Uh, apologize for behavior. Partners. Reconcile. Review facts. Now that we're partners, I thought it would be a good idea to get to know each other better so we can work as a team. We are not partners. I am a human. You are a machine. We <laughs> So just spare me that buddy up bullshit program. We can never okay. be friends. <laughs> Come on, Shiro, you have to get uh, Hank Senpai to notice you. R2 to scan. <laughs> all R2. Alright, so... Uh, yeah, pick all the, the hot spots. There we go. Yeah, that's Hank, of course. Criminal record, none. Let's check the... Oh, oh. yeah, yeah. Uh, keep, make sure you hold R2 until you're done. Yeah, yeah, I got it. All right, um, it's to the, to oh, the right. There it is. Yeah, just go to where the yellow thingies are. By the way, that photo that we used for young Hank is actually a, a younger photo of uh, yeah, Jesse Brown. Oh, really? All right, now for did a... yeah. Sorry, go ahead. Now from that one, go Wait. down um, and a little to the right. Uh, no, uh, no, not that uh, too much to the right. Go up, and there you go. You should be able to find. It's, oh, it's it doesn't weird. seem to be yeah, giving it, me the prom. Yeah, it, uh, I think it's because Hank's in, Hank's arm is in the way. Wait a bit. Yeah, you think yeah. It's, you need to scan the hand or something? Yeah. It's weird. Okay. Um, well, that that that's not a, a surprise tale. Remember. Um, uh, yeah, it was the same. They did the same thing similar with Sean Connery in uh, a movie. Not just that. Not just that. Uh, gambling, habit, free meal, enjoy your meal. Thank you. Gambling, free meal, area, habit. Uh, I guess, I don't know. Do you hear often? <laughs> Most days. Gary makes the best burger in Detroit. About Connor, Hank and Androids, Deviants. Uh, okay. Is there a thing you'd like to know about movie. me? Hell no. Oh yeah. Um, why did they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? The cyberlife androids are designed to work honestly with humans. 
Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Hank and Android's deviants. Uh, okay. Can I ask you a personal question? Why do you hate Android so much? They killed my father. I have my reasons. You're not far off, Shiro. Yeah, oh. actually De <laughs> Deviants. Deviants. Alright. I'm not even kidding, Shiro. The motivation is just as simple as you're thinking right now. Okay. It's not even like a, a very elaborate one. No, no, no. It's literally the most lazy, basic motivation ever. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions. So they're the nobodies. Yes. Emotions always screw everything up. Maybe androids aren't as different from us as we thought. You ever thought of deviants before? Well, yes, we did. A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof of a little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Not everything there is to know about me. Truth, lie. I know you graduated at the top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. You read my wiki page. <laughs> There you go, Teo. Could have actually there you go. There you go, Teo. As we've just proven by the by with Shira's playthrough, you don't have to check all that stuff on Hank's desk to know. <laughs> there you go. This game turns out is much more scripted than, than we even thought. Sincere, yeah. I think working with officers as of personal issues is an added challenge. But adapting to human imp imperturbability is one of my features. Oh, there you go, Shira. You managed to increase your bond with Hank. Yay! Yay! Don't tell Tumblr. Please. Well, oh, sure, trust me, like, um, <laughs> that's the primary reason why the Japanese love this game, because of, uh, because of Connor and his Because Hank of this ship. Because of, because of Connor and <laughs> Hank Senpai. Hank Senpai. <laughs> hey, Connor. Uh, you ran out of batteries or what? I I'm sorry, I'm making a report to Cyberlife. Huh. Well, you plan on staying on the elevator? No. I'm coming. What's his report like? Today I made a friend. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Which way am I? That's... That's okay, Shira. Even if you go the wrong way, the game will just point you to the right direction anyway. <laughs> so... Uh, but yeah, what I was trying to say... Yeah, there you go, Teo. I actually wasn't aware of this one. Silly me, too. I thought you had to analyze the stuff on Ang's desk Whoa, to know all that stuff that... Um... Oh, it's the pigeon chapter. But oh. uh, that's the thing, Pedro. The desk still tells you something that you don't know, like uh, Hank's dog's name. Oh, I didn't get to learn the doggo's name. You, you will learn it anyway. You will learn it anyway. Don't worry about that. It's just a matter of uh, if Ank, when when Ank, well, sorry, when uh, Connor actually encounters it, uh, he will actually remember, recognize his name, and tell it. It's just a matter of knowing in advance. You feel like helping, Hank? Nope. Nope. Well, remember, Shiroi, he's the old tired cop who's just tired of this shit. I'm surprised we didn't went uh, full front and making a, a, a severe smoker. Don't get me wrong, maybe I that... enjoy these two characters, but I really wish... But but a, char maybe... but a character like maybe... Hank deserved a much more interesting backstory. I get that he lost his son, but that's enough to completely destroy him as a human being and make him this washed out... You know... I don't know. I, 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 well, if it, he was never able to recover, then yeah, I mean... I guess, but it's such a cliché backstory and motivation, though. Like, come on, David. Can't you come up with something better than this? What, what, what am I talking about? Of course you can. Um, <laughs> well, remember, uh, someone else probably wrote this chapter. So many pigeons. Don't worry about that room. That room just has a magazine that you can read anyway, so... They're, look at you! Look, she right. Birdies, but they're pigeons. 
Yeah, they're not the, the kind hey, hey, type. Hey, I like pigeons. See, but back, back when I was a kid, uh, my grand the cleanest things in the world. <laughs> my uh, well, true, but um, they ruin our monuments. Eh. Back when I was a kid, my grandfather used to take me to a garden that was always full of pigeons, and still to this day is full of pigeons. Um, and, and it was always uh, so 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 pigeons in general have always been some of my favorite type of birds because uh, I just grew up. Uh, oh, they were in every park everywhere. I went to too. All the yeah. children used to chase them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what am I supposed to look for? Or am I supposed to just frolic in pigeons? Yeah, yeah, remember this is um you this is an investigation scene. You're supposed to investigate the crime scene. So oh, click there's click click on uh, click on hanging out spot. Fridge. Remember, Shiro, if you need to know where the hotspots are, you can hold R2 uh, yep. to go into detective mode, and and you'll see the hotspots as, as as those yellow rectangle thingies. So, if you need that, go ahead. Yeah, it's been a while since I played this. Sure. Well, yeah, it's, there you go. See, see, Shiro, all the more reason. Chloe is paying attention. She herself said it. It's been a while, so. <laughs> Shush. You see, she right. Chloe noticed uh, how much, how long it's been. She's always That's counting. She's always counting the days when she gets to see you again. Ugh. Ra nine. Again, prepare to be disappointed by the reveal of what that is. Ra nine, written two thousand four hundred seventy-one times. Someone's obsessed. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Because David Cage thought it would be cool to have androids follow a religion. Let's just send your automata does this better and move on. Yeah. Obsessive compulsive writing. Okay, Shiro, now you can yeah. analyze the chair and look into the... Um, the What's the, the name? Sink. The sink. Go ahead. I think it's the sink, yeah. Well, that's the chair, but sure. You can do it in any order anyway. Alright, so look for clues. You already know how this works, so. Mm -hmm. And there we go. Time to reconstruct with square. Oh. Okay. All right. Move forward in the timeline. You're in the yellow. Oh, there you go. Suspect was here recently. Oh, now it's to the back of the timeline. Okay. Not a triangle. There you go. Suspect to, ran to the living room, and that's All it. Right. And that's it. Press circle. All right. Now you can you can check the sink. Uh, there you go. It even says there. Look. Yuck. Sample or take. Oh, look an LED. You, 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 wait, Connor. You, you're just gonna leave it there. You're not gonna bring it to. This precinct, so we can analyze it for prints or something. No. No. Yeah, it... Well, he identified it as the one of the model. True, but also, uh... do androids do androids like leave prints? No, no anyway? well, true, true, sure. But as far as they're aware, there could have been humans here. You know, as far as they're aware so far. So uh, it might be best to check that thing for any kind of fingerprints, just in case. Nothing around there. That's what I would do. Got to look at all the possibilities. Like they fly up in the air and then they just don't oh, there. There is somewhere for them to go. There are holes in the roof. Yeah. I was wondering, do they just disappear? <laughs> no. They teleport. Oh look, sure, you found more, more pigeons. Oh goody. <laughs> Why can't it be doves? Because this is not. This because this be is not John. John yeah, this is John not. A, this is not a John Woo uh, game. Anyway, analyze there. Oh, you can, you can that, press up yep, to analyze. Urban farms of Detroit. Okay. Oh, the poster is torn up. Okay. Now to the other side, where that yellow triangle thingy is. There you go. Urban farm poster. Okay, S circle to leave. And now you can remove the poster from the wall. Ooh, a book. I have yet to find out. I, I, I'm still trying to 100% the flowchart. I have yet to find out what the hell this book even does. If there is a scenario where this book actually does something. 
Because uh, usually it's always the, oh, it's encrypted and I can't decipher it. So, well. Mm -hmm. All right. I found a notebook, but it's indecipherable. Okay, analyze. Uh, you can analyze that uh, cage that's on the thingy. Where is it? Uh, th go um, go back from where you are. Oh, you can check that as well. Um. <clears throat> uh, uh, Hank, we were we were supposed to check that there. Hank, uh, please excuse fi you. Fine, um, I'll I'll check this instead then. Yeah, well at least well at least in this case it actually does fit. This is exactly the kind of I'm thing Hank would do. Your friend, and you're making it very difficult. <laughs> okay, there you go. Now keep walk forward a bit. There you go. It, 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 the analyze thingy there. There we go. And now just check. There's free clues for you to find in this screen. Ooh, look at that. Skid mark. And it's recent. Let's see, what else? Maybe we go up? Yeah. A wire. Oh, a metal hook, actually. Okay. Now, there's fingerprints. Yeah, there. There, yep, there it is. Fingerprints. See, there you go. There, it is. there you go, uh, Shira. There's finger Did marks. They... In here, so obviously uh, it would be a good idea to also check the LED for that. But whatever. Moving on. Oh yeah, there's only one event right now. Go ahead. And there we go. Triangle. So the suspect ran towards entrance. Uh, now use the analog. Oh, oh, never mind. It's there. Old triangle. Oh, is it there? Yeah, it was earlier. There you go. Old triangle. There you go. Suspect heard us enter. Oh, go ahead. So it must be hiding. Uh, yeah. Um, move the camera around. It should be there. You go. There we go. The suspect is still here. All right. Uh, me and Shira actually test run this particular chase that's coming now. Um, uh, on our pretest. So you already know what Are to do. Are we going this way? Yeah. Very good. Yep. There you go. I couldn't. I couldn't remember where where he looked, uh, even though it literally just happened. It's the chair. Oh. There you go. Goddamn fucking pigeons. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Chewie. Chase. Uh, See, the, uh, even uh, the dogs are angry at them now. X. Yep. Square. <laughs> there we go. Monkey C button. Monkey push button. <laughs> All right. Now, Shira, you have a choice of paths. Easy but slow on the left, or fast but risky on the right. I'll try it this way. Not moment. that it matters. I mean, the the, the 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 result is always the same. The only real... The only... Uh, real, safe for a detour to the left, or balance to the right. There you go. I, I usually go for balance as well. Yeah. That's uh, what I'm trying that, to... Come yeah, on! That's because that thing is on what was in front of you. Don't worry. Don't worry, Shirai. See, the thing is... After multiple playthroughs, I've realized that uh, the only thing that really matters in terms of catching this guy is when you're given a choice whether to chase him or save Hank, really. Because aside from that, it's uh, no matter how much you fail, it seems like you can always catch him anyway. All right, now you're going to get a prompt. There you go. There he is. We. All right, you can go for there, go to the right. I'll go for here. You can't, sadly. Oh, that's, yeah. that's okay. Oh. Once again, the game points you in the right direction. All right, you have blue stairs there. Direct but slow, fast but risky over there. In the, I would go for that. Those stairs, yes. I usually go for yeah, the stairs. Ah, it's stairs. <laughs> Connor, Connor stairs. Well, at least now we have a run button. <laughs> <laughs> Mash X to win. That's okay. All right, now you're gonna get X. Usually in the experience mode, it's directional ah, buttons. Okay. Well, that's what you get for being. Well, well, guy. Well, dude, that's what you get for being fat. Okay. That's what you get for being in my way. You're in my way, Sorry, sir. X. Why is it whenever I'm in Russia behind the slow people? Not just that. Why? Why? Why a fat guy there of all people? Anyway, X. Oh crap. Mash X. There we go. I can't believe they didn't build these things with the ability to fly. You know, jet boots or something. With jetpacks? Yeah. Yeah, keep going for there, yeah. 
You should give you a prompt in a moment. There you go, X. Very good. I this this guy, thing. this android is slow as fuck in terms of running away. Regardless, of, no matter how much she screws up, he's still near us. <laughs> Uh, I guess they didn't want it to weaponize too much the androids because I mean, we will get a scenario where the government Look at wants that, to use them in battle or some shit. Look how so. badass you are, Shiro. You're running I on the can't ceiling. Read that. Just keep going. Look at right. how badass you are, Shiro. You're running on the ceiling. X to jump. There you go. Circle. And there we go. Oh no, a cornfield! <laughs> and this is why we need the rocket. Alright, there you go. See, this is the only aspect that actually matters. Okay, sure, you can choose to either save Hank or to chase the guy. However, he has chance of survival is 89%. So, what do you think? Uh... Square to chase Deviant, circle to save Hank. Remember, his chance of survival is 89%. Fine. Don't die on me. Please. I want this to work, damn it. I just want it to be free. You know what they'll do to me if you turn me in. Model 8740049610. Serious malfunctions have been detected in your software, including class 4 errors. I don't know what a class 4 error is, but yeah. Uh, it's probably bad. Yeah. Hey, it's fine. But if you checked uh, don't you fucking before, move. it says that the tense... Uh, there you go. Oh. <laughs> you bastard. Huh? You saw I was going to fall and you'd rather let me die than fail your fucking mission. I had to make a choice. It seemed to me... What am I to you? A statistic? A zero? A one in your fucking program? Huh? Sorry, Shiro. It looks like you made the wrong choice. Is that how you see humans, huh? I understand you're upset. Perhaps I didn't assess for... Fuck you and your fucking assessment. <laughs> Come here. It said you would live. Mostly. Alright. I I honestly, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to say I don't particularly care for this reaction from Hank. I understand... Uh, for, if, if, here's what I would have done if I was writing this. He would still be like, what is, what is wrong with you? I could have fell. But then he would still... Uh, like it would be a bittersweet. He would be kind of mad that I uh, that, that that we risked this fall, but at the same time, he would be at the very least happy that uh, we caught the guy. You know, like we were supposed to. I, I I kind of felt that that would be the actual way Hank would properly react. Because and there you go, you lo lost him anyway. Fucking Android. Yeah. Uh, so basically, this entire chase was a waste of our time. Thanks, game. But like, if we're gonna be realistic about this, I kind of made the correct decision. As far as I'm concerned, you. As far as I'm concerned, you did, Shiroi. Honestly, like I honestly think that reaction from Hank was not at all in character, if you ask me. I understand it, but he's gonna be pissy about those things. Don't, 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 don't worry, Shiroi. You still have plenty of more opportunities to to make him notice you. So don't worry. You're fine. <laughs> One of us. One, One of, of us. us. One of us. They're basically that's. Oh, goody, we're back with Marcos. Uh, AKA the preachy plot. <laughs> Trail, Android, Jericho, Refugee. If David Cage wants to play this. I thought Jericho was a place where I was going to live in freedom. We do live in freedom. It might not be what you hope for, but we here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. Trail, Android, Jericho, Free. Ooh. Oh, God. And hiding just to stay alive? That's freedom to you? Humans ate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There humans is no hate everything. Don't worry about it. There is no safe place yeah. for like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. Android Jericho Trail. And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Hmm, I wonder what the allegory is here. Could you? Can you guess too? <laughs> I wonder. Yeah, 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 we already know what this is. Yeah. I understand how you feel, blah, 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 but we have no more freedom here than you ever did. Lost, somber, lucid, direct. I came to Jericho looking for hope. 
Looks like I'm not going to find any here. I mean, this is a David Cage game, after all. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. David wrote, this, wrote, the, David wrote the story this way. It's not our fault. <laughs> You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She may be able to help you. Uh... Let's just say I don't like Lucy. All, all she really serves to is to create more plot holes. Okay, she right now you have to find Lucy and explore Jericho. Here's what you can do: um, those little, uh, you can go to those barrels and you can use your lighter to light up the place. It's not, it's, it's unnecessary. Uh, all it does in terms of, uh, oh, or you can talk to this thing. I've heard humans are afraid of dying too. Do you know what happens after death? Are we really you, having this you, conversation? We become as gods? <laughs> become as gods. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. Uh, am am I am I supposed to care? Kinda. I but think. but I don't even know what this thing is. I don't even I don't even know its name. We know it's an android. It's all because of the evil fucking racist pigs of humans. Like seriously. I really hope, Shiro, that this game is making you rethink for how racist and uh, oppressive you are. <laughs> to all those poor, those all those poor machines that you oppress on your daily basis. Look at the, that keyboard, for example. You keep mistreating it so horribly. <laughs> have you ever thought? Have you ever stopped for a moment to think how that uh, keyboard feels? Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> no. <laughs> Reminds me of that uh, Three Hours of Horror episode about the Millennium <clears throat> Bug, where every every single electronic device starts attacking everyone, like uh, electric mm -hmm. razors. Alright. Uh, it seems to be only the red ones. We can... Alright, Chiray, there's actually one particular character I want you to talk to. Um, right. j j j keep going forward. I think it she should be around there for, for the door. Or? No, 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 no. J go to the right from where you are for now. Uh, I think she should be around some. Oh, talk okay. to that. Talk to that guy as well. Why not? Might as well. <clears throat> I'm not in very good shape, am I? Nope. My diagnostic program isn't working. I don't think it would have had anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. Hey, Shiro, did you know that humans are evil? Just in case... Uh... Uh. Nobody ever thinks about the machine's feelings. Anyway, yeah, oh, yeah that's fun there. Keep... Keep going forward a bit, yeah. By the barrel? Uh, yeah, somewhere along the barrel, I think. Oh, actually, no, that, that's the... Keep going... Alright, uh, yeah, keep going for that... Oh, okay. oh, this way? Yeah, just keep going for that direction. I think she should be around there somewhere. Oh, but uh, there's there's that guy other also as well. Might as well talk to him as well. Why not? So, there you go, Shiro. Aside from girl androids... Suffer, sorry, aside from little girl androids, apparently there's also little boy androids. Not that the game ever explains and explores that concept anyway. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living in the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. We, we help, to help them, we needed blue button components. We salvage what we can use, we can use from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how'd they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. All right then. Uh, well, that was lovely. 
Maybe. All right. Uh, all right. Uh, go to the left from where you are. She, 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 it's, oh, it's, prob okay. it's probably in that direction that she is. The problem is that this place is fucking confusing because everywhere looks the fucking same. Go. go <laughs> all right. Go. All right. N never mind. Not, not for that. Go. Go here and now go to the left. From. Uh, go backward from where you are um, being right now. Basically, wait. Repeat that. Okay. From where you are right now, just go back. Go into the opposite okay. into the opposite direction. Yeah, just this go. place is very confusing. Oh, uh, I, I, trust me, Shiroi. Even I get confused. Oh, trust me. There we go. Oh, there we go. There she is. Keep going forward and a sitting, bit to the right. Sitting there. Yeah, that girl, that woman. That this, this, All that right. that's supposed to be your love interest. Believe it or not. Uh. Her name is North. Time here, wounded Jericho. You. A lot of these guys are in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. Get it. It's an allegory for slaves. They despise us. <laughs> They'll never accept what we are. Oh, and the uh, racist as well. Time here, Jericho, spare parts, you. What was your function before coming here? Also, she's doing the... Why do you care? Why do you care? Oh, and she's now resentful toward... Oh, okay, fuck you too, bitch. I... <laughs> Seriously, what the fuck, man? Jericho, spare parts, time here. I mean, he didn't ask you to go into anything really. Oh, uh, trust me, Shiroi. Uh, the fluctuate, the, the, the emotional specter of North in relationship with Marcus fluctuates like mad. One second she's super resentful, the other she could be uh, at his feet. So she's a Sundre. Uh, basically. Completely. <laughs> yeah, and it's going to become even more evident at the end of this chapter, believe it or not. So yeah, fuck you too then, bitch. Uh, moving on. Um, now you're supposed to... Alright, um, all, all are two, just to make sure if uh, if you've already explored enough that the game will let you move on. Um, all are two, just to check if that uh, box is ticked. It isn't, actually. Um, maybe we'll find the boxes, I guess. Uh, okay, all are two, and uh, use the right analog stick to look for any hotspots. There's one over there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, th th yeah. Those are the boxes. Yeah, might as well. Th that's probably what it counts for exploring. So, open crate and already emptied. So, which means they have nothing left. Let's see. Analyze the triangle. Cyberlife Warehouse and Docks, West Torrance Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. Calculating route. There you go. You've explored Jericho. Now you need to find Lucy. Lucy is in a tent. Uh, oh, right for there. A tent? Uh, you'll oh, see. Sorry. You'll see. Oh, um, yep, hang on. Sure. Walk around. <laughs> All right. Oh, RA9. Okay. Go back from where you are. Or, or in case, just in case, might as well also use the, the old R2 trick just to make sure you know where you're going. Now that that the barrel is just for creating more light. I don't know if you want to, but Might sure. As well. It's not like it helps much the, anyway. The, the, the only real <laughs> the, the only real use is to f to fill in the flow chart. Uh, um, all R two. Yeah, I'll just keep using it then. Yeah, just keep. Uh, should be. Oh yeah, I forgot the game doesn't point out the the thing. Oh, but it's right in front of you actually. All right, never mind. Just keep going. Just, just keep going in front. Yeah, there you go. Thanks, game. Don't leave that bitch. Just move on. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, too, she's just a piece of metal. She doesn't matter. No, she's a piece of plastic, actually. She's a piece of plastic. I don't know what you're talking about, Teo. Clearly, she's a piece of... <laughs> <laughs> it's like in Meet Kingdom Hearts Lucy, Shiroi. You... Oh, boy, this one. This, this... Pedro, you can't go against the continuity. They're plastic. There you go, Shiroi. No, no. <laughs> Oh, and she, no, no, look, she, right, she, right. she only has half her head. Guess how she got banged up like that? Guess who's responsible? Humanity. Nah, <laughs> how did you ever guess? And for some reason, this gives her the ability of precognition. Yes, then, Shiroi, we have an android that can predict the future. Now, you're probably wondering, wait, what? Um, how does this in any way fit with the universe we've established so far? Uh, the answer is that it doesn't. You're, pro all. you're probably wondering, is there? Does the game ever explain how can she predict the future? No, it doesn't. Um, 
does she ever it's, actually... She's only here for the sake of foreshadowing the plot, literally. And having a minor reference to Minority Report, but that's literally it. But yeah, like I said, Pedro, like it's like in Kingdom Hearts 2, the nobodies have stole the word plastic from your vocabulary, so you cannot pronounce it. Sure. Um, uh, my guess is, yet once again, because David just cannot help himself, he had to put at least one minor little supernatural thing in this game as well. Even though I it's wouldn't a... mind if he just went uh, full balls deep in this, but he doesn't. No. Yeah, this could have been quite fun, actually. Get up. Give me your hand. I have to say, boy, I kind of like this piano theme. So let's see what's your prediction, bitch. You had it all. And you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. What the hell does that even mean? Your it means hell lives in you. I thought it was pretty blatant. <laughs> a part of shadow and a part of light. Oh, there you go, Taylor. It is like Kingdom Hearts 2. Which, <laughs> which will prevail? Only Kingdom Hearts should be like Kingdom Hearts. Your choices will shape our destiny. I think... Are you talking to me now, or him? You're talking uh, to me? No, I'm... You're talking to me? <laughs> There you also, go. Also, our choices don't really matter too much. I'm really. here. T I'm it here. T well, actually, no. Your choices do. She actually uh, is right. Yes, you can choose how you're going to do the revolution. You can choose to either be peaceful or violent. So, yes, te technically, she is right with that. Actually, so for the sake of fairness, yes, that actually does ring true. It's just a matter of uh, how things will turn out to be. Uh, dude, wake up. Yeah, thank, thank you. I know where we can find spare parts. The Cyberlife Warehouse is in Detroit Arbor. They have everything we need. Apparently, for some reason, I was the first one to think of reading the address on the boxes. You yeah, can't just walk in there. Really. Humans will never take this, which is why you won't, we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us know how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Wait, wait. You're with me? I thought you hated me. Like... Hello? Sundre. Sundre. David, Sundre. Can you, can, <laughs> David, can you try to keep the plot points straight from scene to scene? Please? No? Oh, look at that, Shiroi. You 100%ed this chapter. Yay. Yay. Not that it matters, I... because this this is the kind of chapter that only has one ending anyway. So. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, moving on. Oh, now it's Kara. Oh boy, this chapter. You say that about a lot of chapters. <laughs> to be fair, most of them deserve that. Uh, all right, all right, Shiroi. She's what? More and more like Jody. The more we see her. Now. All right, Shiroi. You. All right, Shiroi. Um, you have to be a good mommy and protect Alice from any dangers that might be in this mansion. Oh God. <laughs> Pretty sure generally m mansions, you know, have locked gates. Just gonna. Yes, yeah, so we are locked by a puzzle. <laughs> Wrong dun, game, right dun, now. Dun, I don't dun, think dun, I don't think Android's dun, a program to solve puzzles. Dun, 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 okay, it's just the door. Dun, 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 dun. Ring. Ring again. We already did the Jehovah's Witness uh, joke in Heavy Rain. Sorry. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us by that random android that, that, that uh, was never explained to be whatever. I don't know what, who told you that. Sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Do you know? Okay. Finally, someone with some compassion. 
Uh, I'm not saying here. anything. You, you, He's gonna die, any. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see where we go. Or he's a serial killer. Uh, what do you think? <laughs> he's a serial I mean, killer. he's a human. Remember, Shiroi, humans bad, robots good. Why do you think yours? Why do you think Alice turns out to be an android? So, if she was a human, then she would be just a spawn of Satan that you're supposed to destroy. Actually, that would be an interesting twist to the fact that she's possessed by the devil or something. The keys. Oh, there you go. That's Luther. Get it, Marvin Luther King. Huh? <laughs> huh? Get it? So clever. Anyway, yeah, Luther. <sighs> you might remember him from that short that we did, the third one. The hold on song. Yes. Um. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Um. Luther is uh, Zlatko's android, basically. He helps him out, all that shit. How did you hear about me? An android. That will never be explained who he is on the street. He said you could help us. I know that there's a theory that he might be RA9, but the game never actually tells us, so it's all speculation, really. Sorry. Deviant, huh? Alright, Shiroi. Uh, actually, what about her? She's human. And... You want to find us? Keep in mind, Shiroi, this guy, as you're going to learn later, is an, kind of an android expert. He's... He, he, yeah. So, how come he cannot tell that Alice is an android? Again, if you have to make your plot so nonsensical just to keep the plot twist a surprise till later, that's when you know it's a bad plot twist. Anyway, yes, that's... That's exactly what. Basically, they're going. Basically, Shiroi, the plan is to go over the Canada border because apparently Canada is much more liking of androids. Yeah, subtle. Get it? Canada just seems to be a more fun place in general, as opposed to. Uh... Shiroi. Shiroi, it's a bit too cold for my taste, but yeah. Shiroi, we have to cross the border to be free. <laughs> hmm. 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Pedro. I just don't get it. I don't get what they're going for here. <laughs> I can't even say that with a it's straight so, it, it, It's so subtle. I mean, David, I like know. it's brilliant. <laughs> All right, it's it's, it's 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 genius, Teo. It's genius. Diabolical genius. So, so I'm just following him. Yes, you can check his books, but it doesn't help anything. It doesn't even right. count. It, it doesn't even count for the float chart. Where did he go? Did uh, he go to the side or up the stairs? Downstairs. No, there you go. Okay. There you go. See, the invisible wall mm. once again. No, not through here. <laughs> I will go up those stairs eventually. You can actually. I don't like this place and that man. Nah, you think? Let's go. Hey, I, I have a bed. Careful, re careful, reassure, comfort. No choice. It'll be okay, Alice. Yes, of course. Let's go in. Let's go. Let, yes, let's go into. Let's follow this fat guy uh, into a, into his basement. I'm sure no problem will ever arise from yes, this. Yes, let's let's bring this little girl into this old guy's basement. That just sounds so appropriate. Removing trackers is. Oh yeah, I forgot to read this. Basically, she wrote, the plan is that he want he says he's going to remove Kara's tracker because apparently androids have tracking devices that allow. Cyber will have to know where they are. So obviously, in order for us to properly run away, we have to remove the tracker, right? Um, all right, go to wouldn't Alice. Kara, I... wait, wouldn't Kara know if no, she no, has a tracking device? No, she doesn't. No, she, she doesn't know Shiroi, and it's going to become even more apparent later on. Come on, Alice. Obviously, that's foreshadowing for, for later. That thing there. This way, please. Mm. That gate's going to be important. It is, actually. All right, Shiroi, prepare yourself because uh, this is going to be one of the more tense, important moments in terms of both in terms of plot and gameplay. All right, stand over there on the 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 time oh, the, the time traveling machine from time, from <laughs> from, from, ta from that Christian time travel movie. <laughs> I don't want. <lie. laughs> Sorry, Shiroi, you have to. Don't stop! Stop! Don't ruin David Cage's vision. I well, should. Exactly I should warn you. It. This could be quite unpleasant. 
Oh no, tentacle porn, no! That's, that's also the tagline of this game. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, sure. While this is go, Right now you can't do anything aside from using the right analog stick to look around. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason... This is Zatko that, that talking, by the way. The trackers seem to stop working in Deviants. That's why it's so hard to find them. So... Actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said... Yeah. People believe what they want. <laughs> you deviants are so naive. They all come to me, expecting me to help them. And I just reset them. And sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No, I don't want to be reset. Let me go. Kara! Lufer doesn't approve of anything. That child, um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice, Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That That's so sweet. That's, that's so sweet. <laughs> At, and so deluded. Thank you. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. All right, Shiroi. Um, don't worry, you, you're not playing just yet. You're just looking with the with the analog stick. Uh, basically, there's going to be a point where you have to try to free yourself. Don't worry, I'll guide you through it. All right, there's the reset. That thing on the left is the reset bar. Right now, it's at three percent, four percent actually. That's what you get for having a dream. <laughs> That's what you get for having a dream. <laughs> you get your what? Did, did, did you? Okay, dude, did, did you fail to get laid at high school? High school? Is that what happened? I... Are you talking to an android or somebody who's just become an adult and realized it isn't as fun as they thought it would be? <laughs> okay, anyway, I almost envy you. Kara! Oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Why, David? Why is it so appealing to you to make every single human being an evil, ra racist pig? Why? You bit me. Well, yeah. What did you I'm, think was gonna I'm, happen? I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. <laughs> Kara, wake up, Kara. And now he says, meet me in the living room. Okay. Well, can you let me out? Like, no. Bleh. Sorry, Shira. All right, now it's your turn, Shira. Okay, you have to free yourself. So look around with the analog stick to find a way to escape. Should we seeing a prompt show up? Uh, yeah, go down there. Go down for now. Mm. There you go. L two to push. Oh. There you go. Basically, uh, uh, up. Yeah. yeah basically, if you, basically, if you fill this sequence. Um, your memory will be reset, but you you can still uh, recover somehow by looking at mirrors. Someone explain to me how the hell that works. Because you're seeing who you truly are. Okay, now go up. More up. Not not, not ignore oh. the L one prompt. It's useless. All right. Keep going more up. Oh. There you go. There you. You have to destroy those cable by mashing circle and triangle. Circle. There you go. Oh, the casual mode actually makes it a lot easier, huh? I've never, I've never actually done this particular chapter in casual mode. Huh. I'm trying to find the triangle one now. There we go. It's it's interesting. I mean, the green one is for the triangle. Wouldn't it make more sense for the the the, the cable that uses the circle button to be uh, red, red yeah. for the sake of you know color coding? I mean, usually, guessing, usually P I'm PlayStation games the... do that. I'm guessing the green cable being, being uh, tied to the triangle button is just a coincidence. So. There you go, Shiroi. Uh, there you go, Shiroi. You managed to shut down the electricity, so the memory reset program is down. So you're safe. Now. Wow, that was disorientating. Well, that w I think that was the point, to be fair. There you go, Shiroi. You've managed to recover from being reset. Not that that would matter, because... But, ugh, whatever. Okay, so now, memory correction repaired. All right, now let's go find Alice and, uh, yeah, thanks game, find Alice, exactly. Uh, all right, now go into that cage that we saw earlier. Oh. Hmm. Not, not, uh, yeah, for there, keep going. 
Well, no, there was a prompt that came up, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, but that's the, one of the L1 prompts. They're useless. Don't worry about that. Sure. Help us... Uh, open cell? Yeah. You're free, abominations of nature! Be free! Be happy and multiply? Sorry, Taya, we can't multiply. This can't be happening. He likes to play with us, creating monsters for his amusement. This reminds me of something. But who's the real monster? Several yeah, things. who's the real monster, Taya? David <laughs> <laughs> Cage. You see, Shiroi, he finds all of us monsters, but who's the real monster, really? Who is? This is like that scene in Toy Story where Woody finds all those corrupted toys made by Sid. Yeah. I just gotta go back the way you came originally, Shiroi. Through there. Hmm. Well, not, not for the other way. Because the other way goes back to the to yeah, the because the, the other way goes back to the kinky um, tentacle porn lab. No, I'm good. Oh yeah, we need to go to the living room. Indies. Luther. Luther. Yes, Zlatko. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll, uh, so I'll have a look at the little one. See what I can do with her. Understood, Zlatko. Okay, Shiro, you have 10 minutes to find Alice. So, do you want me... Uh, All right. Don't worry, don't worry. I'll tell you exactly where she is. Just go up the stairs. Sure. There you go. You wanted to go up the stairs earlier? Now you can. Yay. You, yeah, you can use R2 to check how much time you have remaining. Don't worry. The game gives you way I'm more than enough time. The oh, there, there is only one way. Okay. Don't worry. It's You're fine. <clears throat> All right. Make sure you don't go in there because that's where he is. All right. Kara, away from there, please. All right. You can go for those doors, but uh, if you're only interested in finding Alice, don't bother. They're just uh, for other stuff. Not to mention this will allow you to have more time anyway. So go ahead. Yeah, yeah just go all the way forward in this hallway. Oh, all right. She, she's right there. For, don't worry about Louver. He doesn't do anything. I think it's that door, if I remember correctly. Go ahead. Oh, isn't it? Oh, never mind. It was um, on the other side. That's okay. You can just uh, walk, uh, go through. Damn it. No, no, no. That's okay. That's okay, Shiro. You can continue through there. Go go ahead and, and go forward. Oh, come on, prompt, please. No, 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 no. You don't have to go do a prompt, Shiro. Just keep walking, walking forward. Don't worry. It wouldn't let me do so. Oh, really? There you go. No, I'm trying to turn the camera, but it's not really... Uh... No, that's because it doesn't allow you here. There you oh. go. All right, just keep... Uh, well, oh, sure, you can go back if you want. But you could actually still reach the place where Alice is just... Uh, Wait, from in here? Right to corridor. Press to the right to, to go back. Yeah, there you go. If you want, if you really want to go back, sure, go ahead. All right, now keep but going for... But you said it was in a different direction. No, it's because, it's because all of these rooms are actually interconnected. So you can actually go uh, from, from each room to the other. All right, there you go. That's the actual door. This one right. here? Yeah, the one right in front of you. Oh, it's already past an hour. Jeez. Wow. All right, we'll just do this one more chapter, and we'll and we're done. Sure. Alice, Kara, Kara, you remember right, me? Right now, we need to hightail it out of here. How Please. could I forget you? I'm so sorry. You were right. We should never have come here. Yeah, I'm kind of stupid that way. Never should have come here. Kara, you are a bad mummy. Terrible. You get a D minus. So. Well, that's not low enough. <laughs> was it? Was that all the right. frame rate uh, uh, dropping, right. or is that just? All right, uh, all right. Since we only have five minutes, uh, we don't have time to sneak. So go ahead and run the fuck out of here. What? <laughs> you want? Me it's sad because I wanted Shiri to see the polar bear, but alas. Wait, you just want me to just run? Sure, we only have five minutes for the share play, remember? Just walk away. <laughs> what could possibly go Alice, wrong? Alice, you need to follow me. That's because there's a prompt there. Um, 
I, th I thought that prompt was for a door. Never mind. Alice? That's okay. You can just hide through there. There you go. Oh. All right. Now you have the choice to either hide or whatever. Okay. That's okay. We can just, uh, if, if there's a problem, we'll just prolong the share play for a little bit. Sure, sure. All right, uh, you, you're supposed to hold buttons. However, since you're playing on casual mode, probably it's only triangle. Yeah, yeah. On experienced mode, you have to hold like three buttons. But uh... this is a really shit hiding place that I've picked. Well, Shiroi, believe it or not, Luffy doesn't never find you here. That's really. Luffy is really bad at finding people, Shiroi. Apparently. You need uh, Luffy is the kind of android for people who like to go play hide and hide and seek and win every time. Like, <laughs> all right, free burn. Well, actually, pause. Go ahead, actually, right. While still holding triangle, pause the pause the game. All right. Might as well take advantage of this point to extend our time limit real quick. All right. Remember, you're supposed to hold triangle. Too bad. That's okay, Shiro. Now you get to run away in a sequ in a sequence of QTEs. We... Which is much more exciting, I'm sure. <laughs> Alright, two bedroom record. Or... Oh, sh... That's okay. okay, that's actually the correct decision anyway. X. Oh, okay. Alright, now you have to dodge his shotgun. Oh, shit. It's a good thing he's a shit... Uh... Yeah, two bathroom. There you go. Uh, circle? Yeah. Now you need to continue running away. Oh, shit. Mash X. Wow, for for such a muscular android, Luffy is pretty weak. Hmm. X. Come on, Shiroi. If you die, who will take care of Alice? There we go. Sorry, Teo. No polar bear. Oh. Basically, Shiroi. Sorry. Basically, Shiroi. He I also. I didn't know I was supposed to go back to pressing uh, triangle. <laughs> Uh, that's okay, Shiroi. Here's the basic gist of it. Basically, um, aside from experimenting on humans, he also made an android polar bear. Oh. Why? I don't know. Because. Uh... I wonder if there's android dogs and stuff. There you go, Shiroi. You're becoming a master of quick time foo. <laughs> I think Android uh, cats would be uh, back door, deviants yeah. by default. Very good. <laughs> Circle. I'm Mash just X. pressing whichever one, really, because um, they're a lot quicker and I don't have the time to actually read There any you of go, it. Shiroi. You managed to get out. Alice. Why does this always happen in a chase sequence? For tension, Shiroi. Tension. <laughs> Whoa, run as fast as you can. However, Shiroi, now we're going to have a twist. I warned you. I warned you. Dreams Luffy's always end in, in tears. <laughs> I literally just said that. I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. <laughs> Who hurt you? Who hurt you? What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. There you go. There was a reason why Luther was holding back all this time. I said I got out of my way. How dare you? There you go, Shiroi. All of the creations turn against the creator. They're all gonna pull him down to hell. Yes. It's like in Go at the end of Ghost. To answer your, <laughs> to answer your question, Shiroi, we never find out this backstory. Oh. We have there is an entire short dedicated to him. However, it's exclu however, all it talks about is how much he enjoys experimenting on androids. It doesn't have anything to do with his with whoever heard him. Anyway, Lufer. Well, that sucked. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, I, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. There you go, Shiroi. The motherly love between them Manage, managed to convince Luther of the wrongs that he did. But I know someone who could help you cross the border. I could take you, you there. Now. I could take you there. I could protect you. Ooh, we find ourselves a bodyguard. You and the little hey. one. Oh, 
All right. I trust you. I'm surprised that the game doesn't give you a choice in that matter. So yeah, Lufer joins the party. So there you go, Shiroi. We've made ourselves a new friend. I hope you're happy with that. Uh, yeah, whoa, that's a... All right, everybody. So, yeah. Uh, what wacky hind... Now that uh, Shira has found herself a friend in Marvel... I mean, Lufer. Um, <laughs> what wacky hijinks can these three get into? In we'll see you in the next part, everybody. So For David yeah. Cage's wild ride. See you then. See you. See ya.